So this is Rainbow Falls behind me. Jamie and I uh, lived in Kirikiri for three years when we first came to New Zealand and I would run the Rainbow Falls track um, regularly and it's a really special place. Um, I love my time here and I'm going to read you a poem that Mark at the physio clinic that I worked at, uh, Mark owns Body, uh, Body Works, he wrote me a poem when, when I left to go to Auckland with Jamie and I'm going to read you it. Hopefully I'll make Mark famous with his poetry. Nat, you came to our workplace from a foreign shore, probably without a thought of what lay in store, but you took to life here like the proverbial duck to water, and you sort of became like a long lost daughter. You added an extra buzz to our happy clinic, though it took us time to get used to words like in it. <laughs> I swear I don't say that. You are a very valuable member of our team, respected by all staff and clients, it would seem. Moving on to shopping centres, cafe latte, the big smoke, you're leaving us poor, simple country folk. Those left can't see the attraction of bright city lights. Look up, gone, no stars on cool summer nights. As you wing your way south to start your new life, at last with your new husband to be his new wife, we hope you remember your time with us here and promise to drop in to see us and stay for a beer. Please accept this gift given with love and affection as you move on with your life in this new direction. We give you the, this old carry bowl in the sh uh, this old carry in the shape of a bowl and a ten dollar note to pay for the Arewa bypass toll. <laughs> Uh, because you need to remember if it all turns to shit, even if we have no room left, we will make you fit. Never forget that Kiri Kiri is your spiritual home and your life is full of ver, viv, and it's never monochrome. <laughs> it's so nice. <laughs> and Kiri Kiri is my spiritual home and I love everyone here, so I'm super happy to be here. <laughs>